Hi, I'm Scott Stein, and today has been iPad Day, the smallest in the iPad line. The iPad Mini has been announced, and this is going to be available on November 2nd. It is 7.2 millimeters thin, very, very thin, and feels extremely light. It's got a 7.9 inch display, and it starts at 329. Now, that's maybe higher up than some of the doorbuster tablets that are out there, but it packs an A5 processor, it's got FaceTime HD. It's got optional LTE for configuration starting at $460. And it's got a 1024 by 768 display that matches the iPad 2s, but the text seems a lot more crisp and readable comparatively because the display is a little smaller. It doesn't feel like a retina display, but it certainly feels readable for, for email and feels more readable than it would on an iPad 2. A lot of people are going to want these, A, for the price, and B, because of the fact that it's more affordable. And it comes in black, and it comes in, so in aluminum <laughs> with the feel that sort of reminds me of the iPod Touch 5th gen and there are a variety of smart covers that fit it as well. Pre-orders start imminently and it will be available alongside the new 4th generation iPad which has an upgraded A6X processor. So these two are going to be available for the holiday season and this seems to mark the resetting of the next generation of the iPad lineup. I'm Scott Stein and this is a look at the new iPad mini.